Kobe Bryant is making his way to the court to meet a very special guest, 11-year-old Marina Pellicciari and her family, who have traveled from New Jersey. All right, man, all right. Good to see you. Good to see you, too. What's up, sweetheart? Good to see you. <laughs> you look so well put together with your Laker uniform. You wear that jersey better than I do. I'm just saying. It was great being Marina. She has so much passion for the game, so much inner determination. Come here, you. Come here. You got to get up here with me, though. You got to get up here with me, though. Now you're taller than me. You can post me up. <laughs> my family are lifelong Laker fans, but my daughter in particular, Marina, has just been a Laker fan and a Kobe Bryant fan specifically for years. What do you think of Staples? Kind of big, isn't it? Marina was born 14 weeks early. She was a pound and a half, and we found out at about 18 months old that she had cerebral palsy, which basically affects muscle tone. It can affect speech, a bunch of different things. Luckily for her, it was really just a physical thing with her left side, her leg, her arm. Good. What do you like doing uh, the most? Passing, like dribbling, passing? Defense. Defense. <laughs> Her dream was to come to the Staples Center and see a game. Come on, 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 come <laughs> it was great to kind of bring her out to the court and have her dribble around a little bit, give her an official basketball. You know, it was great spending time with her. When I was a kid, I always wanted to touch like an official basketball. <laughs> it's a little different, right? Yeah, it's crazy. When I was a kid, I used to love the sound that it makes. I listened to the game on TV and it makes like this because it's a parquet floor, so it's hollow in the knee, so it makes a little different noise. You should keep that ball. Take it as a souvenir. Yeah. We got plenty of them. I remember the day I first got my official basketball, I was like, almost lost my mind. I slept with it and everything. I like the smell of it. A bit of a basketball geek. Oh, yeah. I didn't tell you about the gifts that I'm bringing to her. You're very welcome. You're very welcome. This way when you hoop, you can hoop in style. Okay? I have this jersey for you as well. I'm gonna sign up for you too. Hey, it's gonna go down your ankles. Oh, it's so cool. I wonder if she's even speaking. <laughs> You're very welcome. Basketball is something that'll come and eventually go. The beauty in that is trying to use that time to inspire others, to provide some sort of escape for them. I think that's something that lives well beyond the game of basketball, and it's probably most important. This is official, 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 official. So that's oh, all right. Extra official. Extra official. That's the real deal right there. To watch your kid's dream come true like that, you can't put a price on that. And for the Lakers Association and Kobe Bryant to come and do that for her, there are no words. There are no words. I mean, generations of Pelicciaris will be Laker fans at this point. Yeah, I'll show you what me and my girls do. Do like this. Blow it up. Here we go. All right? Are you ready? Ready? Blow that up. <laughs> <laughs> but it reaches sweetheart. Give me that. Why is your place to meet you? I had fun today and it was great meeting Kobe Bryant. Bye, sweetheart. 24 all day, every day. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Yes. Yeah, same here. <laughs> The elation of meeting Kobe isn't the end of Marina's experience. With gifts in tow, her cross-country trip wouldn't be complete without watching a game in this arena.